And we ended up going out the window, and I landed on Tojinar. You guys made a real... ...real mess. Yeah. Looks worse than the day. Is somebody up there? Hey! Wait here. Enough, all right, just shut it. Son? Toads? I think. Be nice in there, okay? <laughs> Big B! And Miss White! Surely you didn't come all this way just for my bother. Sorry, Big V. It's embarrassing to have to admit, but uh, I thought it was someone else in Woody's place. There wasn't, though. Uh, not when I checked. <laughs> Nothing but a leaky drain pipe. Imagination must have got the best of me. So, you know, false alarm. There was someone, but they took off when we got here. Is that right? I guess your dad's ears have a year or two left. Haven't gone totally to the dogs, eh? All right? Oh, he's fine, Miss White. Just stung his little toe. Better swimmer than Walker, just like his dad. Wanna? So, I guess you'll be taking off now. No need to hang around here anymore. I mean, I'm sorry you came all the way here for nothing. I'll leave when I'm ready, Toad. I just want to check things out first. The longer you talk, the longer this takes. So just stand over there and shut all up. All right, all right. I just don't want to waste your time, is all. Uh, have a seat. Have a cup of tea. Whatever you like. Whew. Grown-ups. Am I right? Uh... Hey, you know what? Flycatcher said you had a pretty awesome insect collection. I'd really love to see it. Is it in your room? It has a weevil. Cool. Just mind the upholstery while you're looking for nothing. Yeah, sure thing. How'd this happen? Fucking hell. Damn thing must have fell off the table. Uh-huh. 
lamp just fell off the table. Well, the boy was faffing about, playing salts and salt fish. Who knows with the lad? Busted too. This place is falling apart. Eh? The lock. It looks like somebody kicked in the door. Oh, for Christ's sake, the fucking lock's been busted for weeks, mate. Right, it's just like everything else in this bloody building. I should probably get that thing fixed. I know something's off here, Toad. And I know you know I can't leave until I find out why. So can we please just skip to the end of the page before I have to get mean? I don't know what you want, Big B. There's nothing going on. There's just... There's just nothing to tell. Look around the room and see for yourself. Everything has its explanation, you'll see. Honestly, Toad, I don't know if I will. And I don't know if I've got the patience to reverse engineer whatever scheme this is. Big boy's in the other room, Big B. Come on now. We're friends, right? I mean, I called you here. Can't we just start over? <clears throat> oh, Jesus! You're gonna tell me, right now, what the fuck happened before we showed up. Big B, I... It even has the faintest whiff of bullshit. I'm gonna... Dad! Bigby, is this really necessary? Oh. What is it? Is it hurt? This is the job, Snow. You may not like it, but this is the job. Dad? Oh my god. Take off your hat. Bigby, you didn't... He didn't. It was that butcher, a, a Tweedle, Dame or D. You gotta strip them down to their johnnies before you can tell which is which. They come bulging in, screaming about something the woodsman had. Or thought he had, I don't know. He tore up the place, beat me up when I said I didn't have it. I tried to go out the window, but he pulled me back in. It's been a whole morning, I can tell you that. What was he looking for? I don't have a fucking clue, Sheriff. I would have told you. I wanted to, really, I did. But he said if word of this ever got back to him, if he ever thought you knew, or Miss White, he'd come back and kill my boy. I even tried to give the bastard a coat. He wouldn't In playing, take it. picking Who's sociopathic coat? choices just like Armando Dad Vincent would act in real life. Here. Being a pass uh, all in all. Sometimes. Borrows. I don't steal nothing. Turn around here would astonish you, mate. I merely repossess what's been left behind. Well, we'll be taking the coat now. If she has next of kin, family, anyone. All right. Fetch him the fur. Fine bit of dress it is. No, I wouldn't wear it outside. Wait. It's an envelope. Fucking hell, of course there is. For my luck, it's a map to some bloody doubloons. It's addressed to Prince Lawrence. Do you want to try and give it to him, or...? I'm sorry, Faith. What could she have been sorry for? I don't know. But maybe Lawrence does. Well, it's been quite a surprising day for all of us, hasn't it? I'd see you out, but I'm afraid of dripping any more blood in the place. It was very nice talking to you, TJ. Thanks. Uh, see ya.
I'll be honest, Bigby. I don't really know how to feel about what happened in there. We got what we came for. Some information. You'll be all right. So, the prince is now? Lawrence is, yeah. It's our best lead. Our only lead, really. When you put it that way. I don't want to stay here any longer than we have to, so let's just pick an approach and stick to it, okay? Just humor me. When the magic mirror showed me this apartment, I think I saw a knife inside, covered in what looked like blood. I wasn't expecting that. Yeah. Well, like I said, let's not overcomplicate things. You can question him while I look around for it. And if he objects? We're here on official Fabletown business, and we can be persuasive if necessary. Or you can. Oh my god. He can still make it. I'll go get no. Swiper. No. Let me go. <clears throat> what is it that you're telling us? <gasps> Bigby, water. Kitchen. Did you find it yet? If you have something to ask him, you should do it now. Is this about faith? Do you still have that letter? Yes. It's only two words, but he died without seeing them. I'm sorry. We need to figure out what happened here and find whoever did this. Is that the same knife you saw in the mirror? Yeah. I don't know why it's over here. I just don't understand. 
Why would someone want to kill him? Strange. Hard edge to this pool, like something was here and got moved. taken before all this bullet passed through the chair yeah the angle works if he shot himself Dusty. No one's read these in a while. What is it? This gun wasn't fired recently. Maybe a week ago. Or more. Fingerprints? They'll be on the grip and the trigger. What are they? Prescription sleeping pills. Doesn't really help. you and I cannot endure knowing that I have this was for the best I'll see you again love your devoted Lawrence hopefully they're together now about all we can hope for at this point Stay here! No! Hey! Stop! Leave me alone!
Inside here. You son of a bitch. Make me run after you. Why <coughs> did you run? <coughs> what? Why did you run? Fuck, man. Because you chased after me. The fuck was I supposed to do? A man's dead. I know how it looks, but I had nothing to do with that. Bullshit. You're covered in blood. Look, I was just asking him about the girl. That's all. When I mentioned her being dead, he freaked out. I figured someone had told him. How was I supposed to know? Shit. Fucker shot himself right in front of me. I couldn't stop him, man. You're looking for the woodsman, right? I know where he is. My guy says he's holed up at the trip trap. We can go over there right now, the both of us. My employer's looking to ask him a few questions, too. Uh, the fuck? Come on. Dumb. Dumb? Yeah, it is. Look, it'd be much easier for you no, to... No, I'm D. He's dumb. He almost looked peaceful. Yep. Except you're lying in a dirty alley. Yep. With an open wound on the back of your head. Yep. Just leave me here. Come on, get up. Guess we're out of options. D mentioned the trip trap. Then that's where we'll go. I'll call a cab. Every time I think I'm getting a handle on what's going on, things just get more complicated. It feels like we're always a step behind. The woodsman is the only lead we've got, and he was one of the last people to see Faith alive. Getting some answers out of him will start to clear things up. I hope you're right. Bigby, be honest with me. Who do you think did this? I know it's still early, but I just feel a step behind. We haven't talked to him yet, but... Uh, Tell me. I don't think anything would surprise me at this point. I feel like Bluebeard has something to do with this. I had the same suspicion. I don't know how or why just yet, but if you're asking, this is his M.O. There's still a lot of questions. We find the woodsman, figure out what he knows, and go from there. Makes sense. That's probably the best approach. This I is wish there was... Sorry. It's nothing. I just... Seeing all this today, there are fables that are struggling worse than I'd imagined. We pay so much attention to the residents of the woodlands. You forget there's a whole community out there to serve. To have to turn to... prostitution. I... I wish there was more we could do. This isn't how I thought it would be. But Crane runs things his own way. Then you should do something about it. You are in a position to make a difference. Obviously, you don't know what I do all day. Right now, I'm the gatekeeper, making sure none of these disenfranchised folks are 
as he puts it, wasting his time. If you really want to help, you'll figure out a way. I don't know. It's just a broken system. The fables who walk in through the back door like Bluebeard, we have all the time in the world for them. You try and come in through the front door, through the proper channels, asking for anything, needing help. Well, I turn you away. Now things are worse off than they've ever been. Well, that's not true. Right. We've had it worse, but not by much. Maybe this isn't for me. I thought public service was pure. You should get out of there. If it's as bad as you say it is, maybe there are better ways to get things done outside of the system. It's something I have to consider. Never took you for a quitter. We're not talking about me. Maybe you should handle this one. Yeah, maybe I should. Big B. I just be careful, please. Don't worry. This will be over soon. I hope so. What do you want, Sheriff? Official Fable Town business. Oh, well, if it's official Fable Town business. <laughs> Look, I'm not even going to ask where he is now, okay? I just want to know the last time he was here. That's all. Who? I'm being nice, so try again. He hasn't been here for a few weeks. No, maybe. I don't know. But yeah, he hasn't been here in a while, if he's been here at all, which... I don't know. Does he tell you when to close, too? Nope. And he doesn't tell me when to tell you to fuck off. Let me solve the mystery for you. They're pickled eggs. Oh, I know what they are. I'm just trying to figure out why anyone would eat this. You got any change for this thing? Nope. talking about the one with the bald head and the beard never seen him whose is that someone who left 
Enough already. Just tell me where he is. I told you. I don't know. A lot of these walk out the door? Yeah, it's called advertising. <laughs> you get a refund? Fuck you. A word's getting out. Come on. Have you seen the woodsman around? I don't know who that is. Big guy, beard, flannel, kind of a shitbag. Hard to miss. Uh, you sure you don't know him? Don't lie to me. It'd be bad for everybody. Call me a liar, and it'll be bad for you. A lot of stools in this place. You got a problem, friend? I don't like you, and now you're sitting right next to me. You could ask me to move. You gonna order something? Or are you just here to bother my customers? You know what I mean. Give me a Midas gold. You want a lime? Sure. I think they have some at the bar down the street. <laughs> Think that's funny? Yep. Think it's fucking hilarious. It was all right. This is fun. This back and forth. We should really do it more often. But, uh, I'm starting to lose my patience. Of paper towels and uh... number one or number two? For your sake, uh, I hope it was two. Otherwise, you're probably shitting your pants right now. You and me have been going at it for hundreds of years. I'm through fighting. Not sure I believe you. You're in luck. I decided to switch seats. Last fellow put his hand on me, ended up with an axe in his head. Last fella I put my hand on, ended up in the ground. Okay, Griff. It's funny. Just a minute ago, no one seemed to know who you were. Yeah, well, everyone knows you. Big bad wolf. <laughs> well, I'm the bad guy and you're a sheriff. What kind of fucking world is that, huh? Not exactly comfortable with it either, but... Hey, you play the hand you're dealt. Well, some folks are forced to play with shit. That's a lovely image. Guess you want to know about the girl. Amongst other things, sure. I'd walk past her place for weeks. She didn't look like it. But she had money. I was sure of it. And she wouldn't put up any kind of fight. <laughs> I was gonna rob her. And the night I finally get up the nerve to do it, there you are, fucking things up for me. You were just in the wrong place at the wrong time. 
Just shut up. I'm taking you in. For what? We've had punch-ups before, Bigby. Never had to get official. Just blowing off some steam is all. I'm dragging you back to the woodland. For what? Jesus, Bigby, that fucking hurt. Hey, stop! This isn't what I want. Oh, shut the fuck up, Woody! Shit ain't just about you. It's about this fucking lapdog. And they come sniffing around this part of town when the rich fucks in the woodlands need a shakedown. Ain't that right, Bigby? Lapdog? Really? Holly's sister goes missing. No one gives two shits about her. Paperwork, waiting rooms, and that bitch Snow White looking right past me, then ushering me out the fucking door. That all you got? Seemed to be enough. Don't be so sure. Oh, good. Should have walked out of here when you had the chance. Come on, you're scaring the lady. Don't worry about me. Enough. This never happened. 
I'm good. I honestly was going to pick the choice of not ripping his Don't arm because I know Armando and Vincent would be pussy ash to go to great lengths. Is this the type of treatment I can expect if I let you take me in? If you run, it'll be worse. Trust me. I got a hundred bucks for the first bloke that can tell me something about a girl name. Fuck. That's not necessary. Shit. He's the one you want, not me. Your brother won't be saving you this time. Come on. You're under arrest. I told you I didn't do it. And you got nothing to worry about. Anything stupid, and I'll throw you down the witching well myself. We had something very special. Where's your brother? Fuck you! Give me one good reason I should tell you anything. Serial killer. Oh, oh my. A serial killer? Oh god, and it's one of us? Wait. The woodsman's still walking the streets. We've got to put a lid on this. If you can't manage it, I'll find someone who can. I found out where she's been staying. You shouldn't be here. It's not safe. You told him? Doesn't matter. Maybe you just want to punish someone. We can arrange that. What did you do? Friend on friend. At the end of the end. Jesus Christ, baby. Is that you? Irresistible.
Thank you. 
Thank you. 
Thank you. 